Hi, my name is Jack, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the MailSlurp test interface with your automated browser tests. The test interface allows you to use email accounts in your automated browser testing. You can create new email addresses and use them for user sign up and authentication flows, then receive email tokens and extract out the content. So to begin, go to test.mailslurp.com and you'll see the test interface login screen. To log in, use an API key from your MailSlurp account. You can find your key by going to app.mailslurp.com, logging in, and then the key will be displayed on the dashboard. I can enter my MailSlurp API key, click login, and I'm presented with an inbox interface. MailSlurp has created a new email address for me, we can see it here, with this ID, and it's waiting for emails to arrive. So if we send an email to this inbox, it will appear here and we can use it in our tests. So I'm going to send a test email just to show how that works. So I'll click this link. It says that the test email has been sent and we see the email has arrived. There's a notification at the top and we can see the email in our email list. Now if I click this, it will open up the email view. We can use this view within our tests to verify content or extract codes. So let's just say we want to extract out that test value. So I can type in a regex pattern like so, and when I hit submit, I can see the matches have been returned. In our automated testing environment, we can assign these values to variables. So this interface allows us to create complex tests in our automation framework without writing any code. We can also use the controls on the main interface to create a new inbox, load an existing inbox, delete the emails, and reset the app. Test interface allows you to create email accounts during automated browser testing in no-code or low-code tools like Playwright or Reflect Run. In the other videos, I'll show you how to use this with specific integrations. Thanks for watching.